Hello, I'm our Facts of March. And here we go again. Uh, YouTube has restricted one of my videos. Your video, California mass shooting and bar proof of setup, was flagged by flagged to us by the YouTube community. On review, we've placed restrictions on how video will be shown. Please note that your video will continue to be available on YouTube. Now listen to this line. This is just flat out why. We believe in free expression, even when that expression is unpopular, potentially offensive to some viewers. That is a lie. Plain and simple. You are a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. They are enemies of the First Amendment. In some cases, flag videos that do not clearly breach community guidelines, but whose content is potentially controversial or offensive may remain up but with some features disabled. That's somewhere between banning a video and a shadow ban. It's like shadow banning except they admit they're doing it. So that's really not shadow banning. Uh, am I going to respond to this? Probably not. I'll wear it like a badge of honor. Because it proves that what I said was correct. Now, I, I'll take us to the video, and I'll show you what it was that tripped my trigger. Okay, here's the uh, picture. This is what tripped my trigger. You see the guy wearing the Reagan Bush t-shirt? Uh, yes, you can buy those. They are on the market. I knew somebody had to make them because he was wearing it. It was quite certain they didn't drag it out of the closet. Uh, some closet from the 80s or something like that. Yes, you can buy those. It's the odds of finding them uh, in a picture relating to the shooting. That is what tripped my trigger. You see, this is proof of premeditation. That this was pre-planned somehow. Lots of finding that are astronomical against. If you walk down the street in the summertime, you're not going to see that. You're not going to see a Reagan Bush t shirt. You might see a uh, t shirt showing a picture of the communist monster Che Guevara. That you might see. But you're not going to see Reagan Bush. Alright. Uh, lots against that are astronomical. That's what tripped my trigger. Now, if you want to get nitpicky here, here's what we could do. Let's take a look at the two on the right and where this guy has his hand. Reagan Bush guy. Oddly, he has his hand on the shoulder of the guy in the center, and it kind of looks like he's propping himself up on him. thought that was a little odd. And then those two are wrapped together in a sheet. A white sheet. Where did that come from? There's no medics anywhere around. Where the hell did they get a white sheet? But that's secondary. I would have let that go. Reagan Bush t-shirt, I wouldn't let. I can't let go. Because it's proof that somebody had planned this. They planned for that to be in the picture because... As so we know, Reagan Bush are these evil Republicans who loved guns and uh, wanted to see Americans dying in the streets because of gun ownership and all that. We have to remember that this is the way these liberal elitists uh, think. They hate Reagan and Bush. So, the juxtaposition of this t-shirt in the video is absolutely, it's got to be, I mean, in the picture, this has got to be pre-planned. There's no getting around it. This is not saying the shooting didn't happen, I'm not saying that. But this was pre-planned. They knew this was going to happen. And they knew that this t-shirt 
they had this t-shirt ready to go. Because you're not going to find it. I'm sorry. I can, I can go down to any festival around here in summer, and I'll never see one. I was stunned when I saw it. Because you just can't find it. Anywhere. Looking at two on the right. Uh, nothing really interesting there. She wears a hat. He, she, or whatever wears a hat. Pretty good at bad decisions. Not interested. That's the only thing that really interests me is the Reagan Bush t-shirt. It's a political statement. It was put in there as a political statement, and that's the way it is. And of course, YouTube and some others don't like it. Because I point out that this was done for a political statement. And, of course, my video gets restricted. So I'll wear this as a badge of honor. Probably not going to try to fight it, because they demonetized my entire channel anyway. So what's the point? Well, there you go. Uh, YouTube has dishonored itself yet again. And they continue to dishonor themselves. I'll never back down on this one, so don't even get me to try. Yes, they saw him. Yes, this was put in the picture deliberately as a political statement. And the odds of finding it are astronomical against. I matter of fact, Mars, I stand by this. I stand by everything I said. Thanks for watching.